Predators are known to stalk, wait until they can have their final attack and take their prey. Have you ever wondered how that happens in the brain? Let's talk about it. Deep in the brain, there is this small little almond-shaped nodule called the amygdala. And specifically, the central nucleus of the amygdala is known to orchestrate every step of predatory behavior. So there's two main circuits. One that drives the stalking and the pursuit of prey. And the other one controls the attack movements, like biting. And together, they coordinate this full hunting sequence. So let's talk about how they found that out. So researchers from Yale decided to use optogenetics, which is a way that we can use light to activate specific neuronal pathways. And so using optogenetics, the scientists activated one of two pathways. The first was the central nucleus of the amygdala to the reticular formation and the brainstem, and the, and the other one was the stimulation of the central nucleus of the amygdala to the periaqueductal gray. So I'm going to show you a few videos of the actual study, which is really interesting. The first is, is a fake cricket they put into the cage. They're going to have the optogenetics attached into the central nucleus of the amygdala. And what will happen is whenever you see a blue light flash and it says laser on, that is when light is stimulating the central nucleus of the amygdala. And you'll be able to see a mouse will normally not really care too much about the fake cricket. And then once it's turned on, it will go and grab that fake cricket and try to hit it. Now this may be a little hard to see, but here in the red arrow, you're going to see an actual live cricket. What will happen is that they're going to turn on the activity of the central nucleus of the amygdala. What you can see here is that actually, whenever that light, blue light is turned on, that mouse will go and get rid of that cricket very, very quickly and pursue it and bite right at the neck. Yeah, so overall, this group found that the central nucleus of the amygdala to the periaqueductal gray is really important for this drive of predatory behaviors. The central nucleus of the amygdala orchestrates the entire uh, drive for predators to go out, seek, find, and go and end their prey. And so this is absolutely fascinating and it's great to be able to see this type of neuroscience in action with those cool videos.